In November, Hamilton County Commissioners designated $1 million in CARES Act money to help local youth related with COVID searches with COVID related services. The board asked the United Way to help select 24 agencies. In this story, you'll see only right here on Local 12. This is how one agency will be using the money. It's an update to our five year long project, Childhood Poverty, Cincinnati's Crisis. So 10 minus five. Whether it's math. It's just five. Correct, right, good job. Learning about atoms. Two hydrogens, you multiply that by two. Or taking gym class. The ladies of leadership are helping remote learners through it all. Good job. For the last 13 years, the nonprofit has mentored 100 young women in Avondale and Lincoln Heights a year with after school and summer reading enrichment programs. Then the pandemic changed their headquarters into a mini remote schoolhouse. Yes, I call it the Ladies of Leadership uh, Remote Learning Academy. They provide one-on-one -on -one time with 20 students. They review their work. They're in communication with the teachers so no student falls behind. So we're just actively involved in their entire school day. They sought out funding help because it was not a long-term program. It started off with like, okay, six weeks. Okay, great, we can do this. Oh, okay, great, another six weeks. Okay, so this is our 15th week, right? And with it, they saw growth. Their desire to learn has drastically improved. And they watched children who hate school learn to love it. During our summer reading and enrichment program, we had kids who didn't know how to spell their name, who weren't reading, who did not know how to identify letters and numbers. And then they carried over to the remote learning center and their transformation is just monumental. Currently, the program helps 20 learners from K through 12, many who don't have reliable internet at home. The program received $58,000 to be an alternative site for children to learn remotely while the parents go to work. The CARES Act money will help them add seven more students and the ladies will lead them until remote learning ends. That's what keeps our tanks going because we see this transformation from these young people and we just, we just have to be that bridge. And until then, the ladies of leadership say, Akuna Matata, no worries.